Hey, welcome back again. Uh, glutton for punishment you are. Well, let's punish you with some more information on how to manage this website. In this lesson, we're going to talk about how to add a page and add it into this menu up here. As you can see, this page has a couple uh, sub pages. And we're going to actually add a page underneath the contact so that the main contact will bring us to this form, but there'll be another one underneath called contact him and it's just going to have some rough information there for me just as a demonstration so the the steps here are two parts first you have to create the page or the content then you gotta marry it into the uh, menu as it will this menu I believe is called the main menu I think that's what I called it so there's only really one menu in our system so what we're going to do is we're going to jump over to where you're already logged in we'll just start here at the home page um, where you usually drop. So we log into the management console and the first thing as I mentioned to do is we're going to go ahead into our pages and we're going to create a new page. So I'm just going to hit add new and we'll put some content in here. First things first is to give it a title. This is going to be important because it shows up on it. This is going to call Mr. Tim's sample page. How's that? And in here we're going to put uh, if you need help, call Tim. And I'll put a picture in here just to show you. We'll add media. And we'll just put my logo in here. Which one's smaller? That one's pretty small. We'll insert that one. Actually, I know what that is. That's garbage. That I gotta delete. Apply this one. That was something else I actually let me go ahead and delete that. That was something from another lesson. We'll insert that one and you'll get the logo there and the and my phone number is eight six seven five three oh nine of course. I must live with Jenny. So that's an eighties joke. So I've created my content, here's my page. Okay, a couple things. If you're going to have pages and you want them listed in a particular order at a particular level, you would use this order uh, option. In our case, it's going to be the only subordinate page to links. So let me take you back and see what, show you what I mean. These are all pages, and I've set them in order. This is order number 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, and 80. And I did that skipping by 10 so that if you decide you want a page in the middle here, you can make it 75 and... It won't show up in this menu, but the way it lists in our pages, like when I go um, into the list of all pages, it'll list in the proper order. It's a little helpful. This page is going to be subordinate to this links page. Uh, I'm sorry, contact us page. So it's going to be a sub of that. So I'm going to make its parent, because it's a sub, contact us. If it's not going to be a sub, it's going to be a root page, means part of that actual menu. I wouldn't do that. I'd leave it as no parent. But because this is going to be on Contact Us, what's really cool is we can actually publish this. I'll go back to the real site, the live site, and refresh. And we'll see Contact Us just takes us to this page. So, why is that? Because this menu hasn't been updated with our page. If I knew the page I needed to add, which I don't actually know what my page is called, or I could type it, uh, Mr. Tim Sample Page. So I could go back and I could add that on the end here, because the page is there. Uh, that did not work. There it is. And this is Mr. Tim's sample page. The page does work. It's just not referenced anywhere in the menu to make it easy to find. So what we're going to do is we're going to go back here. We've made our page. We updated our page. Our page is created. If I go to all pages, it should be listed in here right there. And the dash lets you know it's a subordinate to the one above it. So now we've got to add it into the menu. And that's part of our appearance. So I'm going to go here and then go down to menus. And this is our menu. You'll notice this is matches our menu along the top, this thing, with resources having two subordinate things, and it's even in the same order. So all I have to do, it's actually quite easy, is I find Mr. Tim's page, 
and I add it to the menu and it pops it in and then I drag it where I want it to be which if I drag it there it's going to show up along the main menu I don't I indent it it's going to show up indented pretty cool right so I'll hit save menu and now when I refresh this contacts us has Mr. Tim's page underneath it it's that easy and if you go there you'll get my page so it's a little bit of drag and drop that's how you would add a page remove a page and manage the menu here what I'm going to do is we're going to take this one and I'm going to have to undo what I did which was let's uh, hmm. Here it is, remove. So I hit the down arrow, remove it. I'll save the menu again. And if I refresh this, it should go away. And it did. So we don't have a, oh, it's still there. Maybe I didn't refresh that yet. So I now no longer have a Mr. Tim's menu there. Um, that's about all you need to do. Actually, for cleanup, I'm going to go ahead and delete the page. I'll show you if you make a page how to get rid of it. So I'm going to highlight this one. You can actually move it to trash from right here or bulk actions. You can move it to trash if you do it more than one. So I'll just trash it right here. Now, it doesn't actually throw it away. I didn't click it. I swear. There it goes. So it's gone, but you'll see there's one in the trash. So I'll go into my trash and I'll empty the bin just to make sure it goes away. So that's how you add and remove uh, pages and you add them in and out of the menus. It's quite simple to do. You just got to be careful when you drag and drop that menu item first. Um, just to recap, appearance, menus. Now that I made the page, I can select it and add it in here. It will show up at the bottom and you have to drag it not only in the position vertically but the left and horizontally just so it's indented or part of another page uh, menu. So um, that's it. And you save this menu and you're done. We thank you for watching and we'll look for a couple more videos here.